just did an entire video and it had no sound. So we're going to try this again. Um, this is a, my Unity project for Cinnamon. She's a little gingerbread keggy. Uh, she is the V2 Tall. You can find her on Darby's Gumroad. I will put a link in the description below. Uh, I am here to show you guys how to do blend shapes. So all of these clothing were added in Blender. Uh, there's a whole video that Darby has done on her YouTube and it's in her Discord. You can go there and she can teach you how to actually add the clothing. This video is just to show you how to make all of her body shapes match the clothing because they don't automatically do that. So, um, right now I have the body of Kiki selected over here in my inspector. I have it locked, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna wait for that. So, you wanna start off by going down to your project, scroll down so you find female Kiki tall, click on your animations, and then click on customization. And this is where you find all of the animations for all of her different body shapes and sizes. So what we want to do is we want, you know, to make the armors, the arms thicker or thinner, uh, the booba bigger or smaller, the belly, the neck, you know, everywhere that the clothing is sitting, we need to make sure everything talks to one another. So what we're going to do is we're going to go through all of these and we're just going to click, drag, and drop right onto the hierarchy. You want to go to the female Kiki V2 tall full because this is who we're working on. You will just go through these and drag and drop all of them that are in regards to her body shape. So we have arms thick, arms thin. Uh, we're going to leave the neutrals alone, but we're going to go to the belly chub, the belly thin, the big booba, and then, you know, here's like her big cat, bow off, bow on. We don't need to worry about that. Uh, we're going to go to the cake big, that's her booty, cake small. Then we have the calves thick, calves thin. Just keep looking, looking, looking. So here's the feet. We want to make sure that we grab the feet small as well because Kiggy's feet can get bigger and smaller and whatnot. And you want to make sure that the little ankle right here will work whenever you make the feet small if you like her feet, her little feet being tiny. So then we keep going, scrolling through, looking. Uh, there's the small booba. Then we have the thighs thick, thighs thin, and that should be all of them. If I missed one, I'll come back. Uh, so next thing we need to do is we need this little animation tab right here. Everything that we just drag and dropped over here is under this. So you have this little down arrow right here. This shows you all of it. Now, if you don't have this animation tab, you need to come up to window scroll down where you see animation and add animation and it'll pop up and then you can drag and drop it wherever you like i actually just prefer it down here just the way i organize things now the way that i'm doing all of this there may be a, another way to do it but this is just how i was taught and i'm just showing you guys how how i like it so i actually i have two inspectors over here because I just, I personally like to have it. Now, if you don't, you can just go over to the three dots right over here, add tab, and then add an inspector. Then you can also drag and drop it wherever you would like. So I like to click the body and I actually lock that up here. So then all of this just stays here. This is all of Kiggy's body's blend shapes. Then we can move on to the actual clothing. So I'm going to start off with the choker. So the choker, the only blend shape that it has is wider neck. 
But if you look in all of these animations, you don't see wider neck, but that's because it is connected to the belly chub. So what we're going to do is we're going to click the record button, this little button right here. And that puts her in this cute little stance. And right now, uh, I just did the blend shapes for this one, so that's why it's already like this. It's already red. Um, so this is what it normally looks like, and you can see that you know the neck it, it just it sucks it up. And then I also did the the belly already as well uh, in my my last video. But um, so we're gonna go back to the choker. Gonna make sure that this is up and everything works. And they want to make sure and go back to this so it actually saves this right here. So I have that already down here. Then let me show you one. Uh, let's go to the small feet. So we have the feet right here. He's so cute. Look at the little feet. That's going to be on the socks. So right here we have all of the blend shapes. And so you have the feet minus. So then we press the record button. She does her cute little squat. As you can see, her little feet, they don't quite quite fit, they're a little big. So we will just drag that to make it smaller. Then we press that button once again and that saves the spot, that saves the blend shape. And then now it's where it's supposed to be. And then you just go through all of these so and make everything talk to one another. So let's do um, uh, it doesn't matter. I can do all of these. We'll do we'll do the calves. So got the calves of the socks. So um, this is really important. Make sure before you press this record button that you come over here and make sure that everything is at zero when this record button is not on in red. So it just does that sometimes. I'm using the the 2019.4.31 F1 Unity still. Uh, the update just came out, so I haven't been able to play with that yet. Uh, so we'll do the, the calf. Press record, as you can see, it's clipping through, looks kind of silly. So we come over here, that's all you do. And then make sure that you go back and press this so it actually holds it in place. Then we'll go to the calves then. So, you know, it looks fine, but you want the thinner calves. So we're, we're gonna record, go to the calves like that. And there you go. And then we're gonna do the same thing with the uh, thighs, we'll go ahead and do the thighs. Don't worry about the the little thing right there. That's because of that's a blend shape for the summer outfit. So I can go over that here too as well. So thick thighs. We're gonna press record. As you can see, you know they go through, but that's okay. Just turn that up, and then rinse and repeat for the thighs thin. Make sure those are all at zero. Record, thighs thin. And just like that. Now, so what you'll do is you'll go through all of those, and once you're done, you need to go to click on the female Kigi V2 tall. And you want to find where it says controller. Then you'll see this right here. You want to click this little circle with the dot in the middle. Scroll up and click none. It's very important. Um, it can break your project and just do weird things. So I just like to make sure that that says none. And that's how you add the blend shapes. Now, say you had like the summer outfit, you just didn't want it on there, but you still had this going on right here. But that's okay, because what we can do is, oh, well, I'm right here. 
So this is the, the Kigi body. So all I did was I clicked on body and uh, I'm gonna remove this one, close this tab, uh, which is this right here. We're gonna scroll down, scroll down, scroll down, and then you see clothes, shorts on. That's what that is. It's so that there's no clipping whenever the summer outfit is on. So you can just turn that off and it goes back to normal, but I like to keep the summer outfit because I think it's cute and I like to retexture it. So we're not gonna worry about that right now. Um, there's an animation for it. So like whenever you toggle the outfit off in game, that this goes back to normal. So I don't, like I said, I just don't worry about it. I hope this video helped at least a little bit. Um, if you have any questions or if you'd like me to show you other things, uh, feel free to ask me any questions. I'm in Darby's Discord. I will also link my Discord as well. Um, any other links that I've referred to in this video, like Darby's uh, Gumroad, will also be there. And I hope to make some more of these videos, and I hope that you enjoyed it. I hope you have a wonderful day, and thanks for watching.